Hey, what's up everybody? It's Adam with DIY Agency and today we're going to check out Sort Express and see how AI can actually help you with your paid search and uh, your paid marketing campaigns. So um, real simple, it's uh, sortexpress.com. Um, they do offer uh, all kinds of different plans. Uh, what we're going to talk about today is the free plan to start with um, and then the difference between uh, what I would say is probably your best choice, which is the AI assistance plan. And then if you're a corporate entity, um, the, uh, the monthly plan. So basically what you're going to do is just go ahead and create a free account. And you're going to have to fill in some information um, about the website that you're looking to uh, work with. And so what we're going to do is we're going to put in a couple different, um, and these are autofilled, but um, you know, really what we're going to do is want to have a couple different website addresses. And here's the concept. If I'm driving a, um, a paid search campaign, which I wouldn't do for high level, um, I would want to drive either um, you know to a couple different destinations depending on what the, the keyword search is. So, for example, if I'm looking to just get a generic uh, person to the landing page or homepage, I would you know want to send them to a DIY agency. If I'm looking to get them to the pricing page, um, I would send them to a pricing page. If I'm looking for them to find out any specific um, capabilities, uh, I would want to take them to that keyword relevant page. Um, and so one of the things that we're going to do is, um, you know, look for and set up um, a, uh, a landing page where, you know, when the actual visitor converts and submits their opt-in or they buy or whatever, um, they get a thank you page. Now, the reason that I want to talk about this specifically is because um, for affiliate marketing, it's not always going to work unless you're sending them through um, your own website. If I'm trying to send them through a third party website, uh, it's going to be sometimes difficult to have a thank you page, but it does give me some options on, um, you know, submit form, whether it exists on a page, um, you know, whatever it is. Uh, so if it is high levels page and they do end up submitting uh, information, a lot of times with an affiliate program, they'll give you kind of a, a thank you results page, um, which you can enter that value here. Um, for my purposes, a lot of time what I do is I'm driving people directly to my site, even though it is a um, affiliate marketing plan, I'm going to have a, a DIY.agency slash you know, high level and then um, looking for an opt-in. So if they do opt-in, then I'm going to drive them um, with, uh, with an email automation campaign behind the scenes but I'm also going to put them on a specific landing page after that um, to watch a video or get more information and that's where I would enter in this value here and then really what we're going to do is we're just going to copy a script and put it into the body section of your website so um, if you're not familiar with how to do this um, I do recommend that you uh, learn how to place header code into your website but basically what we're going to do is just copy that code um, and we're going to enter it into um, the header section of our website and uh, then just hit go next. Um, so now this is where it does get a little bit complicated. Um, it's about the only complicated part that is uh, involved, but if you uh, utilize WordPress or, uh, or any other kind of uh, you know, CMS, um, it's going to be pretty easy. So um, we're just going to create an empty landing page on your site named um, you know, uh, Sword Express and we're going to create that website with that page. Um, there is a reason for this, but more importantly, let's uh, just set it up and uh, assume that we're going ahead and creating this page in WordPress right now. And then we're going to start sending traffic um, to that landing page. And the way that we're going to do that is uh, we're going to actually um, have a code. All right, so once we see that actual um, campaign set up, what we're going to do is we're actually going to just drive our traffic from our Google ads or our Facebook ads or Instagram ads to this specific landing page. And really the reason being is we want to um, then track what the activity is of the uh, people coming from those pages. So as we kind of, and I'm going to take you behind the scenes um, of a campaign that's already been run. Um, so let me do that now. So I jumped on a call with the owner of Sword Express today and uh, walked through exactly what I, you know, what I wanted to talk to you guys today about. And so um, really without having to share the video, um, I did record the call. Um, the, the key components of, of what we're tracking and what the AI specifically is going to be able to um, provide the best results based on is um, first and foremost is the operating system. So uh, whether you're coming in through Windows, uh, Linux, uh, Mac, um, 
it's going to deliver um, a page based on that that uh, that result. Um, whether it's a device, whether it's um, again, whether it's a specific um, handheld device, uh, an Android, an iPhone, uh, desktop, um, it's going to provide the best experience based on that. Um, the browser, and again, this is all based on engagements and, and conversions and the like. Um, whether it's again on Opera, whether it's on um, you know, uh, Chrome browser, Safari, stuff like that. And then, of course, um, you know, you can create uh, other data points, um, whether it's, uh, you know, a, a location. So if I have, um, you know, multiple languages that I'm targeting, if I'm tar targeting multiple countries, um, I can have different uh, results pages based on that. And the AI is going to sort this all out. Um, as well as kind of just keywords. So if I'm looking for three different keywords or, or 10 different keywords, all I'm going to do is just create different data points um, that it allows uh, to track based on. So again, if pricing page is, uh, if somebody's looking for pricing, they're going to the pricing page. If they're looking for a demonstration, they're going to the demo page. Um, and so, you know, we spent a lot of time walking through this uh, stuff and, and it really was um, as simple as you know, again, kind of as I demonstrated, you're, you're, you're literally just going to set this stuff up in, in moments and, uh, you know, be able to track data and uh, run your campaigns. And again, the key being that you're able to figure out um, the, the AI is going to calculate what the best results are um, for you. So that's kind of just one to one, what I wanted to share with, uh, with you um, is that not only have I, I tried this out myself, but I actually got on a call with the owner to kind of demonstrate that. So. So when entering that keyword in here, what we're going to look to do is just, uh, you know, create a, or when we enter in that code, we're just going to put it in and it'll look something similar um, to that. Uh, obviously, it'll be a little bit different because it'll be on my DIY page. So I'll have the tracking code and uh, again, I'm just going to enter it into the final, final URL section there. So that's how it works. Um, these guys work with a ton of big companies. Um, there's been uh, plenty of good reviews about it. Um, but really what I, I again, I want to focus on is who's this for? Um, so it's really made for anybody that is running paid search campaigns or paid advertising campaigns. Uh, whether you run a, a small business or if you run um, an affiliate marketing campaign and what you're looking to do is track by, you know, uh, provide the best information um, relevant to whether they're uh, coming in via mobile or desktop. Um, you know, if they're coming in with a different language, um, it's, it's a nice little thing uh, where, you know, again, you can track based on, uh, you know, what country they're coming in for what spoken language, um, what browser, if they're coming in via Google Chrome, if they're coming in versus Bing, something like that, um, providing different information. And then specifically for me, it's about keywords. So again, if I'm trying to get somebody to, um, to see reviews, I want to make sure that, uh, you know, they're seeing the reviews page. Um, you know, if it's about pricing, I want them to see the pricing page. And uh, the beautiful thing is, is that the AI will actually do this automatically and figure out what the best um, landing page is for them and uh, what kind of results. So um, thank you uh, again to Sword Express for uh, walking me through this process. Uh, I'm looking forward to uh, trying this out. And, uh, you know, if you want to try out with a free account, um, the link below is uh, going to get you that. And uh, I look forward to uh, the next video. Thanks.